Hey, what's going on everyone? Today I will be reviewing the brand new Thailand made Noah Go Check. In 2020 case B. He is a brand new clutch aid next gen. Now we have Dino Drafty, and I believe his name is Kevin Shiftright. I'm pretty sure that's his name. And these are the two other stock cars for clutch aid. Now he is the brand new next gen. I just recently, just the last video reviewed Easy Idol, the Harvey Rodcat. So yeah, so you can see his nice big card art with like all the different clutch aid designs. It's more like I think clutch aid is like first aid kind of thing. You see Harvey Rodcat and I forget his name, the shiny rat wax next gen. Paul Conrad and Ryan inside Laney have all the different next gens like Danny Suarez, Lightning, Chris Roman, and Cam Spinner. And then we have these different ones back there. And you can see Rev and Go, HJ Hollis, Dino Drafsky. So, yeah, so, so you see Dino Drafsky in the back there. Just a little bit far in the back and that means that at this time of this photo Noah was not an X-Gen yet so he wasn't sponsored by Clutch 8 quite yet. Will the impressive next gen racers break Lightning McQueen's winning streak? Yes they will. So yeah I'll be right back and I'll open and up. Wow, he looks amazing all opened up. Like in person, he looks even better than on camera, but he looks amazing. He might actually be my new favorite next gen. Probably, if not my favorite, then my second favorite. But, I mean, I love Cam Spinner and Richie Guns it. Oof, that's not good. Um, back there, I really like them, especially Richie Guns it. I really like them. Um, Cam Spinner as well, but... And I do like Harvey Rodcap. He's probably in my top five favorite next year. Just move the camera. Okay. So he looks amazing here. A little bit grainy around the eyes. Well, actually, the eyes are pretty grainy. But, I mean, I guess they're fine. Thailand seems to be getting maybe a little bit better. So his racing number is 121. Just like the rest of the... Clutch Aid Racers, you have the Clutch Aid thing, so there's like this, all these like little, I'll call, I'll call them like the crosses, even though they're not really crosses, I'll just call them that, there's all these little blue crosses, and the blue, and all this um, green, whatever rectangle kind of thing, and it's like this dark green fades into white, I mean, light green like this lime green up front here i guess two air vents or whatever vents grill nice determined expression two headlights which i really like there are two or whatever all these little rectangle things and then there's these whatever uh like his rims are like this green, I guess kind of lime green, and then you have the thin next gen tires with the thin, small light year text around them. Exhaust pipes, the arrow to indicate where to lift, to indicate the pit crew where to lift them up at to repair them or take off the tires. That same little rectangle thing, that same little thing you saw up here, except um, more in a greenish color. 121 Con contingency sponsors are the piston cup carbon cyber combustor and synergy a little bit hard to read but i already knew them so that's fine more of the blue with the little crosses go fading into the turquoise kind of color and then going on to this green now it, he does not look nearly as good as he does on camera 
so he really does look really nice in real life. 121 up on the roof with these two roof flaps, window bars, which it looks like they're changing up the window bars. I feel like they're not like plastic pieces anymore. They're like, well, at least this one's like, well, I don't know. Maybe this is just no go check, go check because his windows are not a separate piece. They're like part of his body, which is weird, but it's nice, really nice. But Harvey Rodcap here, his window bars, yeah, I guess they're kind of different than normal, but on Harvey. But anyways, his nice spoiler is a green spoiler, but it goes from this nice blue to turquoise to green to lime green. It says clutchade, and that's the only mention of clutchade. Oh, only, there's only two in like, before there's so many different clutchade logos all around. It's like completely changed. Even the colors is rookie stripes, two tail lights, the little white cross thing, and all the fading colors. Probably my favorite next gen now. M42A made on the 42nd week of 2019. Okay, so now I will compare him to the other clutch aid racers starting with um you can see this is Kevin Shift right I believe is his name very basic and then goes to more complicated whatever Dino Draftsky and then goes into a really nice Clutchy, I guess, really nice. Noah Gosek, Gocek, I keep saying, I don't know, I think it's pronounced Gocek, it could be Gosek, Gosek, I think it's Gocek though, so, I guess you can see how, like, the, they turned from, like, just that to that, I mean, the colors completely changed, like, they almost took away the light, they, took away this dark blue, but they took away that dark blue in Dino Draftsby. Um, they took away this, like, blue. They took away, like, almost everything. I mean, it's like a completely different sponsor. I mean, you could technically, I guess, if you took off this stuff, like, I mean, if you re-sponsored this but kept all the decals, just maybe say this Nitro Aid, it would still be Clutch Aid, right? Because... There's like that cut and then you have the band-aid over it. But I mean like this is like completely different. Like you could just put something like into a cola on there or something like full wheel drive or synergy on there and it I guess people wouldn't really even know and change the number of course, but I mean they're like completely different besides for the crosses I guess are the same. So yeah. Let's compare him to H.J. Hollis. I'll compare him to three next gens. Okay. And both sides are identical, I believe. Steve Slick the page from the next gen four pack. I don't think so. Or maybe there is a... I don't know. Oh no, hopefully not. It looks like there's a little scratch. That's not good. That's on me though. But hopefully I could get another to keep in the package. Just like I have three Chris Romans and three Barry DePetals, two uh, Richie Gunzits, and two of the whatever his cam spinner just because those are my top favorite next gens so i want another couple to be in the package so yeah that was chris roman i just compared him to yeah i mean i guess there's something small i don't know if you can see it on camera though but something small there which is sad but 
I mean, it's not too noticeable. So, anyways. That's it for now. I'll see you all next time. Bye.